Good morning students I hope everyone is safe and fine at home We have completed our chapter 7 the study of continents South America and from today we will start with our chapter 5 that is minerals So open your book page number 84 Introduction of minerals Minerals are an indispensable part of our life indispensable means essential or very necessary so we can say that minerals are very essential part of our life minerals are in the earth crust as we have three layers of earth middle is the center that is core which is in a molten form then is the mantle which is in a semi solid form and at the top is the crust which is in solid form so all the minerals are present basically on the crust part minerals are extracted in the form of ore extracted means to take out ore ore is a naturally occurring solid material from which a metal or the other valuable mineral can be extracted for example bauxite is an ore of aluminium after the ore is extracted it is processed and used for various purposes after extracting bauxite aluminium and other related minerals are separated and then aluminium is used to form different things like aircraft doors utensils etc so it's the example how we process the ore minerals are vitals vitals means important so minerals are important for a country's economic growth social behavior and technological development so minerals are also used in agriculture food products automobiles utensils construction of buildings energy production and transport hence we can say that minerals are valuable natural resources and they constitute the basic raw material of all industries if we talk for a difference between minerals and ores 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 are minerals that have a high concentration of a certain element typically a metal for example bauxite is the ore of aluminum and sphalerite is an ore of zinc in short we can also call it as a metal bearing mineral or a rock or we can also call it as a native metal basically all ores are minerals but all minerals are not ore then is minerals a mineral is an aggregate of two or more than two elements aggregate means combination so we can say that a mineral is a combination of two or more than two elements a mineral has a definite chemical composition and is formed by inorganic processes inorganic process is the process in which chemical composition is without carbon for example iron ore copper gold and silver are metallic minerals mica and limestone are non metallic minerals so this much for today further we will study in next week till then thank you